From our previous videos, we know that a triangle, uh, all of its interior angles add up to 180 degrees. For a quadrilateral like this, um, we can split this up into two triangles. We can split it up like this, just draw from one corner to another. And what happens is that we split it up into two triangles. So we've got 180 from those three angles and 180 from these three angles. So in actual fact, the total must be 180 plus 180, which is 360. So that means that no matter what quadrilateral I draw, the three corners, the three... Uh, interior angles will always add up to 360 degrees. So we can use that fact to solve problems like this. So here we have a missing angle x and I have a quadrilateral here. So actually I'm missing this angle that would be very useful to find. So I know that I have a 90 degree angle, 111 and 109. These add up to, well that's 1, 9 is 10, that's 2, that's 11, and that's 3, so 310 degrees. So the missing angle must be 50 degrees, because they must add up to 360. So that means that the missing angle is 130 degrees, because we can, the two angles must add up to 180 on a line. So the, three, the four angles inside the quadrilateral add up to 360, and the two angles on the line add up to 180. So you can see how these facts that we've worked through, they just need to be ingrained so you can solve problems like this.